to show you how to create finished good items in Dynamics 365 Business Central using the assembly transaction. To get started, I want to look at an item I've got set up as an assembly item. Let's go to items. It's this item right here. Let's take a look at this item. If I scroll down to replenishment here, I can see that's an assembly item. Also, the policy is assembled to stock as opposed to assembled to order. Now, assembled to order might be like a sales kit. Assembled to stock is a simple assembly transaction where I'm going to create a finished good based on the components associated with that assembly item. To see those component items, I can click on the assembly bomb right here. It'll show me all the items that are in that bomb and the quantity that are in that bomb. I can edit the list from here if I wanted to. Now let's go back and put this into an assembly transaction so we can actually make the finished good items from this assembly bomb. I'm going to go to planning and orders. I'm going to go to assembly orders. So I'm going to create a new assembly order. I'm going to click on the next field, look up the item. It's this item here. And I'm going to make a quantity of three. Tap through that, it'll fill out the remaining part of the form. Now, if I want to, I can just save this as it is, or I'm going to go ahead and release this. And this is the direction to my warehouse to uh, assemble this particular item. And once they've done that, I can go back and I can actually post this. So I'm going to go to posting, post assembly transaction. It's going to create a new finished good. It's going to create a quantity of three. It's going to use these component items down here at these quantities. So let's go ahead and post that. Let's go back and look at that item. Here's the item card that we're just on. From here, I want to navigate and go to availability. And I'm going to go down to item availability by location. This will show me which items I have in inventory in various locations. If I scroll over to the right here, I can see that I have six of the assembled item in the main warehouse. Let me click on that. It brings up these transactions here. And I want to see this entry, so I'm going to click on Actions and hit Navigate. It's going to bring up a number of different types of transactions that were created when I posted the assembly order. I'm going to go to this one here, click on one, and it shows me the order. It shows me the order, it shows me the quantity of the components. This is all you really need to do in order to quickly assemble an item in Dynamics 365 Business Central.